first step is I always use a tourniquet. It gives us some venous congestion. So the next stage is that we get blood from our patient. So the next step is that we transfer the blood we have we, into these test special test tubes. We got approximately 30 cc's of blood. There it is. So this is, we use this one for balance. Here it goes on this side. This is the side with our blood goes on this side. And so we're ready to spin it. We're gonna first spin it for a minute. There it goes and it's starting and it's gonna to go to 4,200 RPMs for one minute. It's starting to rotate inside very slowly. So when we spin, you could see how the blood and the plasma separate. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna just pull out the plasma there it is all that gold yellow golden fat the yellow golden plasma there it is all that you can see and then when it starts getting bloody we stop that's it so we ran our prp one time now we're going to run it a second time but this time for five minutes to really separate it so here we go so you can see we have 20 cc's of PRP right here. Look at how nice and golden it is. We're gonna use that all over the scalp, all the way from the front to the crown region. We're gonna spread it all along. So you could see the crown to the front. Here's our PRP. So we're gonna use the vibrator and we cold use the ice. All this uses a mechanism to help the patient tolerate the procedure better. So we're gonna go in, little pokes. This is a small 30 gauge needle. And we're just gonna spread every, about every half a centimeter to centimeter apart and put little aliquots of the PRP. So here's the crown area. This is called the crown. So we're gonna uh, put some right here. Here's a pole. Good job. Okay. Little aliquots of the PRP going in. And uh, within months, we should see more hair growth. It makes the hair stronger. You'll see less fallout. And the ones that are intelligent, that are ready to fall out, will go back to antigen, which is the good cycle of the hair, which is the long cycle, and it won't fall.